Hello everyone, welcome back to the channel. This is The Daily Dose and uh, we have another news and update for today. So this could probably be our last news and update this year. Uh, we're, we're heading close to uh, a great new year ahead. Hopefully next year will be so much better. <laughs> and uh, I wish you guys a happy new year so advance happy new year and again a blessed uh 2022 to everyone so in today's episode we'll be doing updates uh reaction and reviews on some latest cards from hot wheels and uh yeah i hope you will enjoy this one please subscribe if you haven't yet and if you are new uh, I mainly do diecast uh, updates, news and updates, uh, unboxing. I also have RC car videos. Uh, as of the moment, I have stopped that because of the storm. So it's quite hard to make videos of that. But I'll, I will be making more soon. So yeah, let's start today's episode. With this brand new upcoming Zamac Big Air Bill Air from Hot Wheels. Beautiful one right here. Always a big fan of Zamacs. Unfortunately, again, in the Philippines, we don't have them in stores. But uh, if I have the opportunity to buy one at a good price, I'll definitely buy them. So this one right here looks awesome. It has pretty much the same tempos as the painted Big Air Bill Airs. But again, the Zamac finish looks absolutely stunning, especially with this casting. So great job right here from Hot Wheels. Big, uh, big fan of this. Let me know if you also are uh, waiting to get your hands on this one. So again, stunning car. And yeah, let's move on. Here's the next car. Check this one out. An upcoming super treasure hunt. Uh, Volkswagen Kaffa Racer thanks to Abba Jam is here for this by the way so again take a look at that beautiful color I love the I love the red man that is a beautiful dark red on that stunning Kaffa Racer number 44 I don't know what the, exactly that means but yeah stunning piece great looking set of wheels right here uh, as you're seeing right now yeah what can you say about this leave a comment down below and uh, here's a comparison between the main line and the premium aston martin valhalla so hot wheels will be releasing a main line aston martin valhalla by the way thanks to hot wheels malaysia for this so as you're seeing right now not a lot of differences uh, in the uh, in the colors so pretty much the same color i think the details it's pretty much the same man i don't know it's kind of hard to uh differentiate the differences between both uh, except for the set of wheels of course uh the, ma the main line has plastic tires of course the uh premium has real riders but again i can't figure out what the differences are between both cars so again leave a guys i mean uh you guys leave a comment uh down below and here's uh, some updates on the upcoming cars from mini gt so as you see right now a lot of them so first right here to the left we've got a couple of corvette c8r uh, variants by the way the c8r is like one of my favorite castings right now uh, from mini gt also from hot wheels i do like this car a lot then uh, the white one right there, Shelby GT500, looks awesome. We got a recolor of the Bugatti uh, Vision Gran Turismo right there. There is an LB Works BMW M4, pretty stunning piece right there. And how about the white Nissan GTR Nismo GT3, absolutely stunning. I also like, like that green Lamborghini Huracan Evo a lot. Kind of reminds me of the latest uh, premium Lamborghini uh, Huracan from Hot Wheels. I think that was a Fast and Furious uh, car. Then I love that LB Silhouette Works GT Nissan 
uh, 35 GTRR version one right there. I think that one was the uh, one with the change livery from I think Motul to yeah, Liberty Works. Then of course at Lancia Delta Integrale right there. Looks awesome. That green Bentley flying, uh, what's that spur? Not too, I'm not really familiar with the car, so pardon me for that. Looks fantastic, man. Uh, yeah, then of course, another Land Rover Defender. Uh, Malaysian Army variant, so crowd favorite, but again, uh, don't don't get angry with me, with this. This is just my opinion. Uh, the Mini GT Land Rover Defender 110 is, to be honest, at least for me, is getting quite boring. Uh, I think uh, we could agree with this. Uh, we need more variations of cars and not just variations of these uh, castings. So, yeah, and also that Ford GT Mark II looks absolutely fantastic yeah, and yes some more right here a lot more another uh nissan gtr nismo gt3 right there and black one that looks fantastic man that is stunning bentley bentley continental gt3 right there the blue one is also absolutely perfect then of course at land rover defender 90 pickup with the uh, car hauler trailer right there that is dope and uh yeah that one man that one is a must must buy certainly a must buy 100 percent a must buy then more ones right more cars right here we have the audi rs6 really clean absolutely stunning another recolor or another color variant of the audi rs6 in daytona gray right there we have like a lime green or almost like a yellow BMW M4 right there to the top right. Uh, a white version of that also uh, is included in their upcoming waves. And that pink uh, Abbey Silhouette Works GT Nissan uh, 35 GT R version 1 is again just beautiful. Another a Nissan right there, 35 GTRR in matte black. Looks stunning and Liberty Walk car. We got a red Bentley Continental Flying Spur in Dragon Red. Uh, another color variant, another variant of the Bentley Continental GT3 right there down below. And of course, that stunning unique car that is the Mazda RT. That's the first time I have seen that car, man, in like 164 scale. I don't know what other brand makes that, but yeah, that is fantastic. Another must have right there. So more updates from Hot Wheels for next year. Uh, we have another recolor of the Tune Volkswagen Golf right here. That is beautiful. Again, part of the Tune series, of course. I think this looks better than their first uh, release. So this is probably one of Rio Asada's uh, last design cars. Then of course a green Greenwood Corvette. That is stunning, man. That is beautiful stuff right there. Then next up, uh, we have another variation of the Baja Bone Shaker take a look at that big fan of that let me know in the comment section down below and uh, last right here uh, thanks to one stop diecast they're accepting pre-orders for this by the way so this is the latest hot wheels american scene box set so as you're seeing right now it contains five cars and just beautiful cars the orange one is a chevelle ss the green one i think is a Dodge uh, Charger Hellcat. Can you guys correct me if I'm if I make mistakes here? Then at the middle, it's a Ford Bronco R, of course. Then to the right of that is a Corvette C8 R. That is beautiful. And uh, lastly, right there to the right is a I think a Tesla, a Roadster. So really great set. Uh, my favorite again would have to be the Corvette C8 R. Big fan of that. Uh, as of uh, the moment so 
anyways what can you say about this release is it a must buy or not leave a comment down below so yeah that is all i do hope you enjoy this one uh, if you did please like the video again subscribe if you haven't yet and uh, yeah stay tuned for more have a great day guys thank you so much for watching again advance happy new year to everyone i hope we all have a blessed 2022 ahead of us so again thank you guys and uh, yeah thank you so much for watching bye bye